In the prior part, we learned how to move our bow in doing this pendulum effect, I guess. We will do this. First, you find your rhythm. And then we talked about the, the end. 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 And one thing I want you to consider is dividing this pendulum not only in half point, but also in three, the triplet, which you see right here. Here we have a quarter note, two eighth notes, and then a triplet. How would you be able to count this properly? This is in the uh, Albinoni Adagio. So you have to be able to divide our pendulum in a matter of not only we're going to divide, this is our, we have to divide one, one, here's the eighth note, eighth, ba, 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 ba. But you don't necessarily vocalize it, it's something that you feel, because you have to then divide it right here, the last beat, you have to do three. So then you have to go one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, eighth notes. Ba, 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 triplets. Ba, 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 ba. Your constant is your pendulum. This is your constant. But your brain's going to click from eighth note, eighth note, to then triplet, triplet, triplet. Turn on your metronome. Crochet, quaver, and then triplet quaver. My British students will tell you that's correct. Or quarter, eighth note triplets. So here it goes. Ba, 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 ba. And what that was is me vocalizing this right here. I'm vocalizing the quarter notes. We're going to start our pendulum again. B, ba, ba. Ba, 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 ba. That wasn't exact. I need to time the ta, 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 ta. So that was a triplet. Got to get into it. Two and three and four. Boop, 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 boop. Get in there. Dividing your music into digestible bits, as what we did here with this Albinoni Adagio, is going to really help you. But in order to count a variation of rhythms with the correct timing, now we have this conjunction of both rhythm and timing. If you're now noticing why I make this distinction between what is rhythm and what is timing, this is a prime example of what that is. One, two, three, four different rhythms, yet your timing must be correct. So if you need to, try to do that. Try to do your physical manifestation of your metronome. This is at 44 beats. You notice how I add this hand to it? I don't know, it makes you feel like I'm, I'm really getting into it. And when you're ready, D, da, 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 da. I think I'm ready. <sighs> So apparently, apparently, if you do this while I play, it's going to help you if you, if you really continue doing as you feel that. That's a good thing. <laughs> You're like a cheerleader, like doing this. Uh, <laughs> I was like, why is he continuing? Why are you doing that? The student on the other side of the, the camera here uh, continued his pendulum as I was as I was uh, talking about this, and <laughs> and. Um, and it's because it helps you feel, right? You know, if you, this is probably something you ought to do. You should start to feel. A lot of you don't know what this is. This is conducting, right? I'm not going to expect you to learn how to conduct. 
Uh, but you, I do expect you to learn how to pendulum. I do expect you to learn how to do this because we're still. You can do this, but I think this is a little. I think this is a little more uh, familiar to us because then you're also controlling your bow at the same time. So what the student did is, as I was playing, he continued to da 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 da. He was able to feel that triplet, eighth note, and quarter note transition. Good stuff. All right. That's part two of how to learn how to pendulum. That's including triplets and variations in the rhythm. Now let's see you do it at home. That means you, I'm talking to you. <laughs> so you do it. Absolutely, absolutely. Like that's the thing. Like w men with long hair, um, we got to like. If you want to have luxuriously long hair, if you just have it, there's two different guys. Dread it up if you just want to have it. But if you like to take care of your, your, you know, your, your gig, then uh, you got to scrunch it. It's just end of. There's just, there's, there's no, there's no two ways about it. All right, back, all right, back to what? Back to the music, right? <laughs> 